Okay, it's Andy Graham with the Ask Andy Show. I wanted to, uh, my, my sister April must have went on an airplane trip and took a, a thing of uh, sh hairspray uh, and busted. I, I wanted to make sure that uh, she knows how to carry this stuff. Somehow the lid was even on, but the best thing to do is get some, uh, uh, this is a roll of uh, electrical tape. Just average record tape. I take, I pull the core out of it so that it's smaller and it's really flexible. You can actually pull the middles out of these. And then all you got to do is uh, go around just about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven times till you got it like that. And I've never had them open, but uh, I don't use hairspray, but I use, I do this on uh, shaving cream. Okay, and. The great part about this is not that my mother was talking about uh, duct tape, and I then then what you do though is you should take it and, and then uh, put it in a bag like this, roll it around two or three times, then double bag it. Then you're really safer. But if you really if you're really feeling thingy, you know. Putting this inside another plastic thing, like a Tupperware thing, would make sure it's really safe. But okay, so you get there, and you know it sounds like it's really thing, but tape can be reused. So what I do is I just pull this off, comes right off. Oh yeah, pretty long. Because it's electrical tape it comes off. I usually just hang it up on the wall. I'm out here in a windy day. Hang it up on a wall and then uh, next to the wind in the mirror and then I would go and put it back on. I guess I'm not going to do this to my mom's thing because I borrowed it but you can see you can use it right again. So it's re reusable two or three times, four or five times. I don't know how many times. I never really tested it. But uh, if you're trying to carry uh, hairspray, this is a great way to do it. And uh, but but just for protection, you really got to make sure that you put it in the, in a place where it's not going to get bent. So you don't want it on the outside of the bag, close to the edges where everything could get hit and break this break this part right here. Really, you want it somewhere inside, in like tucked in the middle part of the bag. So you got the bags this wide. You want it in the middle somewhere, like in in between your clothing. And you don't, because you don't want to have them drop the bag on the edge and try to break that seal right there, right? Um, but that's how you do it. It's uh, easy. If you have trouble uh, carrying something or you want to know how to carry anything on them, I, I carry, on a regular basis, I carry uh, light bulbs. And I have a special way to do it. And I carry about anything you'd ever want to carry and don't break it. <laughs> okay, Andy Graham, Hobo Traveler com on the Ask Andy Show. This is HoboTraveler.com. Thank you. We can pack up tomorrow.